Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well. I was in the cleaning business for 36 years, as you all know by now, and I quit my job. So there's going to be a series coming up of ways to clean. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly and efficiently change a bed. So first of all, obviously strip off your dirty sheets and I always wash them at 60. We all have bed bugs. Obviously, if you've got stains, then spray the sheets with some uh, stain remover first. I don't have any flat sheets. I've got rid of them all, so I'm just going to do it with the duvet cover. But you'll get the gist of it. So all of it. So once you've got your sheet flat, you tuck it in at the end. I haven't left enough there. Actually. <clears throat> so tuck it in at the end. that nice flat end and then the side just pick the side up you get hold of this you bring this up so that you've got a kind of fold there going up and then just smooth that off that gets tucked in so it's nothing left hanging and then you bring this back over So that that fold is then fair and then you tuck that right in so that you end up with a nice fold there and you haven't got the bulk of the corner of that sheet just sort of sticking out or just hanging in a funny way so it's folded it's tucked in and it's out of the way okay now, if you use the sheets with the elasticated corners the same as I do now, obviously just open the sheet out. I mean, these are obviously easier, self-explanatory, really. Just it on, just tuck it under. Obviously, make sure you've got the right size. If you've got a double, have a double sheet. If you've got a king size, have a king size sheet because it does make a difference. Just tuck that under. pillows on. As I said, I do have undercovers for the pillows. I've cha I have changed those today. So I put the pillow with the, la the label in, I put in first into the undercover. And then the opening of the undercover goes in first into the pillowcase. And then it's all tucked in there. Tuck that in. So again, the end of the pillow with the label goes in first into the undercover. And then the opening of the undercover goes into the pillowcase first. And then the duvet cover is 
one's poppered, so we'll just it's easier. I think the buttons take a lot longer, but it's everybody's choice, isn't it? Zips or buttons or poppers. So I just open that and I just kind of shuffle it up so that I've got the corner at the top of the duvet and the other corner. And I get the duvet. We've still got our Sim Summer one on at the moment. In fact, we probably won't even change it. As I say, we get we get too hot. So the end of that one goes in there. And then I just bring it down a little bit. And then this corner, I just find the other one. Hold that, and then just kind of bring the duvet down a bit. And then I find the bottom corners. Pop that in. And then the last one. And that's the other thing with the duvet. I have the label at the bottom because if it's up the top, it's irritating. So I always put the label at the bottom. And then I will do it up. So really this whole job should only take maybe 10 minutes. When I've stripped the sheets off, I do always leave the bed to air. I will open the windows and just let it air for a little while. Just so it freshens it up. And then what I do is I pull it off the bed and just give it a shake down. It's easy with this one because it's a light one. Obviously, if you've got a heavier one, you might not want to do that. You might just want to, some people just shake them on the bed just by doing that, and that will get the duvet up where it's supposed to be. And then that's it, really. Just pull the duvet up so that it's tidy. That's all gone in there, lovely. I just kind of flatten it out and then I'm not a pillow fan <laughs> but I just have one pillow which actually goes with the curtains which I just pop on there like that so that's it hopefully that was a quick and easy way <laughs> I know there's some extra bits in there and I will see you very soon so thank you for watching and please like subscribe and share bye bye for now